Joe, for this group, what opened up and changed in that third quarter that allowed you guys to put up 42 points? Uh, we limited their second chance opportunities. We were better um, on the defensive glass and then limited our turnovers and created good offensive opportunities for us. It was another night where we got to showcase and see the amount of shooters that you guys have. How fun is it to have so many teammates that can get to their spots and not go down? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a luxury of this team. Um, a lot of space on the floor for, you know, primary ball handlers, facilitators, and then, you know, when the ball is moving, getting guys shots. Um, it's definitely a fun way to play. Um, and, you know, it's an unselfish group, so typically giving up good shots for great shots, making the extra pass, and, you know, it's always always better to play that way. What, what worked so well that you guys were able to hold Trey to just 3-12 and 12 shooting from the field? Um, I mean... To be honest, I don't know if it's a whole lot of what we do. He didn't seem to be um, as aggressive as he has been. Um, yeah, kind of leave it at that, I think. <laughs> when you see Mikel Bridges have a game like he had tonight, at this point, you've seen it time and time again, but like, just what was your just overall just impressive level of seeing him go off? Yeah, I mean, this has become sort of commonplace for him now. Um, I mean, even earlier this season, even when he was in Phoenix, he we played against him the other year. He, was the primary guy in our scouting report with him and um, his ability offensively. I think, you know, for most of his career, everyone focuses on what he does defensively. But, you know, he's shown this year in particular, and especially since he's been with us, how, you know, excellent of an offensive player he is, too. Did you envision that, like, when he first came over from the trade, that you envisioned a world where he'd be having 40-point games, 30-point games for you guys? Or? Uh, no, I mean, I didn't envision a lot, though, to be honest. It's kind of a whirlwind when everything is going on, and then everybody kind of fills into their roles, and, you know, this is where we're at now. Kind of, I mean, going off the joke, like, when does it kind of flip from, like, surprise to, like, expectation with him doing that with you along, when you're alongside him? I mean, I don't think it's ever a surprise, and I think, you know, the expectation is just to come in, play good basketball, and, and try to win games. And, you know, Mikhail is... Uh, you know, his aggressiveness offensively allows us to, or puts us in a good position to win games.